besides the standard sonar, the Garmin Striker 4 also comes with a flasher so you can use it for ice fishing. Let me show you how I set mine up and give you an idea how to work. All right, let's show it first. Here's your Garmin 4. This is a screen for your standard sonar. You can see 8.2 feet of water, water temp 32.26 degrees. Now let's go ahead, go back to our main menu. We're gonna drop down to flasher, set it to flasher. And there we are again, 8.2 feet. As you can see, the mark on the side, on that left side at about seven foot, I'll move it around for you. That's my jig. We're gonna watch that up and down. Of course, we get a few fish in the area. You can actually see the fish coming right out for your jig. But now let's take a minute and let me show you how I set this up so I can put it right in a bucket and make it easily portable to bring along. I've got the finder sitting right here on top. What I have is a piece of styrofoam that it sets in. Now below this piece of styrofoam, is a coffee can and those two small batteries in there those are small six volt batteries that go to my deer feeder so I put in the two six volt batteries I have that green wire is a jumper cable it goes from the positive one to the negative of the other and that turns two six volt batteries into one 12 volt battery from there I hook the power to the other end you can see the red and the black that now gives me 12 volt power and I now can run the standard fish finder off of two six volt batteries. The whole thing fits in the bucket. For the transducer, I mounted that with a piece of half inch PVC and a bolt, T on the top, transducer cord comes through and the handles just come off. So that way everything can fit right down in the bucket when I'm done, put the lid on it, close it up, and everything's taken care of. When I come to the lake, just put the arms on it, set it down in, and we got our fish finder running. So that's it. The Garmin Striker 4 makes a really good flasher to use out there ice fishing. Thanks for sticking with me. Subscribe to our channel if you would. Hope to see you again real soon.